Hey there, everybody! How's it going? I'm back! Back here aboard the cafe! With you, Captain! Yeah, I'm here too. Very happy to be back with you, Wendell. Oh, it was so good to see you. I, I hope you didn't miss me too much. Oh, well, we muddled along, but yeah, we missed you. I see we've already got the chat going. We got Mochi Puddle. Hey there, Mochi. Welcome back, Wendell. Thank you, Mochi. We got Pea Ninja waving. I saw Scarlet Unicorn in there, getting some drinks and some food. Oh, it's great to be back. It's nice. It, it, we're getting all things all cleaned up here. As you can see, I got, uh, you know, I got most of uh, Art's stuff gone. We got uh, just a little bit there left. And I'll be cleaning that up soon, as soon as I can find a shovel. Because that one is uh, starting to smell. He did leave a lot of stuff. Yeah. It took a little while to clean it all up. Oh, hey there, Kotavi. Welcome. We're just getting started here. Kind of a nice little evening, nice little relaxing evening here on the cafe. And as you can see, we got a beautiful sunset out here because times are changing. Fall is here. We got to roll back those clocks. Do you get you have all your clocks rolled back, Captain? I'm pretty sure we hit all of them earlier. I'm sure there's one somewhere though that I'll find in about two weeks. There always is. There's always one. Mm. Whoa, five bucks! Thanks, man. Oh, just gifted a sub to Kotavi. P Ninja oh, thank did. You. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We really appreciate that. And enjoy those enjoy those emotes, Kotavi. You can post my little face in the chat there. Yeah, that's so, uh, where was I? Oh, yeah, I was saying uh, there's always a clock. There's always a clock. Does, I, I suppose everybody gets that. You know, you got the, you rolled the clocks back, and, uh, you know, a week or two later, there's always going to be one clock somewhere. And you're going to freak out and be like, oh, my gosh, what time is? Oh, forgot to roll that clock back. Or There's spring usually it forward. also one that you don't remember how to set, and so you yeah. just like leave it. Exactly. You got that one, that one sneaky clock, and you just want to say, "Forget it. I'll just wait the six months, uh, and then maybe it'll be the right time again." It'll be the right time again at some point. Yeah. Eventually. So. You just gotta be patient. I can. That's how I like to do it. Make sure to get your watch, Wendell. Oh yeah, I got my watch, right here. Says it's uh. It says it's high noon. So that that sounds right. Now, did you change your watch, Wendell, to the correct time? I mean, it was right before, so I, I think it's good. Yeah, I, we'll have to check that at the break, maybe. Might have to look that over. Hmm. Oh, well, we'll see. I, I, I like it. It's good like it is. I like it. With both the hands right at the top, it looks nice. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Oh, P Ninja says, got to remember the car clocks. Yeah, there's always the car clocks. You know, those are the tricky ones. You know, sometimes they're really confusing to figure out how to change those. I don't have a car, so I don't have that problem. But I know a lot of people, though, that's a hard one. That's a hard one sometimes. Got to pull out the manual and figure out what button I got to hold. Hold three different buttons and step on the gas. And then I can change the clock. Or you just leave it and don't worry about it. Yeah. That's yeah, not a big deal. Just get around where you're going. Anyway, we got a new game, don't we? We do. Yeah. And it, it looks pretty relaxing. It just came out. Uh, we just got a hold of it this week on the Game Pass. The Game Pass is really great for just giving us all kinds of stuff to play with. So I'm going to just, I'm going to get it switched over here. Do the controls. There we go. Unpacking. The story of a pig. 
And his crayons. And a creeper. I think that's just my icon on the Xbox. I hope there aren't creepers in here. That would not be relaxing. No, I mean, I don't think there's creepers in this. We guess, just got that one. I guess we'll find out. Creepers just hanging out up there. Meteorite, bring in the fire. Good to see you. We're just getting started. We're just figuring out what this game is. We have not played this. No. Oh, bring in the bits, 100 bits. Oh, thank thank you. you so much, Meteorite. That's so nice. We didn't even do anything. We're getting bits. I like that. <laughs> looks like a piggy bubble bath. Yeah. It looks so... Yeah, Mo oh, Mochi says this looks so cute. I, well, yeah, that's what we thought. We saw a trailer, and it looks adorable. Mm -hmm. And we want to try it. We want to see what it's all about. So, Captain, whenever you're ready, okay, take we'll us go. in. Oh, we got books. Oh, oh okay. There we go. This book belongs to... Oh, we can put a name. Oh, I know what you're writing. Should we put you in? Yeah. <laughs> My book. This is your book. Right there. Oh, we're going back in time. 1997. It was a very good year. 1997. Oh, I got a book. Oh. No more Artita. That's right. It's Wendell Show now. No more Arteta. Come here. here. Yeah. Oh, there. Oh, that's a good place for a book. Oh, we got a raid! Oh. We got a raid with Warcry Mango, raiding us with five raiders! Welcome, everybody! Welcome, raiders! Welcome! We're just getting started here, me and the captain, playing a little game of unpacking. Which, that's what you can, you can see, that's what the captain is doing. Turn that around. There we go. This game is, it seems to be about putting your things away. Oh my goodness, there's too many of these now. So many toys. All right, let's unpack something else. Oh, oh a soccer ball. A ball. Uh, Where would you pack, unpack a soccer ball? I don't know. On the shelf? Oh, I've got these things. Oh, those are good, a good place for action figures. Face forward. Forward. There you go. Mango says, I am very bad at putting my things away. Well, you know what? Today, we're all going to learn. We're going to learn a little about putting things away. With, an, with a dramatic simulation. Ah. Uh, do I have a hook somewhere? I don't think I have a hook anymore. Scarlet Unicorn says, this seems very similar to the Animal Crossing New Horizons DLC. Put all the things in the right places. Make it look pretty. Yeah. That's what we're doing here. We're just, we're going to make this room look all nice. I don't know where to put all these things. Okay. I'm better. I got another book. P Ninja says, I'm better now than I was in 97 at putting things away. This is I, You know what? I don't even know if, I, if that's true for me. So. <laughs> Are you bad at putting things away, Captain? Uh, yeah. It depends on what it yeah. is. Let's say that. Can I put this upright? I can't. Throw it on the floor. Yeah. I've got, a, I've got other... Oh, there's the other side of the shelf. Okay, fine. We'll put it in there. Okay, well... Throw that one on the floor. Well, if we had some of these I have to stack, so... Oh, Ooh, what's boy. that? It's a picture? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, it's a drawing of a horsey. Horsey and drawing. We'll put that on the wall. No piggy bank. Oh, this is calm. Won't stack anymore. Are we stuck? Okay. Phoenix just says, I do have less CDs now, though. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I still okay. got them. We got Simon. <gasps> we got Simon, everybody. We got Simon. Oh, it's going to oh. be a fun night. And a dreidel. Dreidel. Very cool. And a Rubik's Cube. A Rubik's Cube. Are you sure this isn't the 80s? No, it's 97. Oh, that looks like checkers. Procedure. Oh, that, oh. <laughs> Procedure. I, that looks like a different game. Different name. Okay, now I don't don't like touch it. the sides. Oh. You sit there. Procedure. You stay there. Now I don't like the books over here. Oh, we're getting picky now. Well, uh, that's, that's like... Yes. Here, take you out. Yeah, All we'll right. put that book there. This 
is where put the procedure over there. This is where the games go. Oh, that's right. We should put all the games in the game place. Oh, we finished that box. Finished the box. We're doing good. Scarlet Unicorn says, that's not Simon. That's Samson. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Samson says... I need an area. Okay. Warcry Mangoes, I can't tell you how much time I spend decorating my Sims house. Tell me. Tell me how much time. I would I want to know. Cause that is a that is a good use of time, I think. Have you seen my Minecraft stream? I have to sit there and make sure all the torches are in the right place. A lot so many hours. It's a good use of time. I could do that, but I don't think these will sit up right. Level they traits? Won't. Nah. Oh, Decorate! Boy. We're decorating! Yep, yeah, you sit up right there. Yeah. Oh, look, we're just stacking the books all nice and neat here. I don't oh, like that books. they're not in size to order. <laughs> I mean, I, do we need that kind of... We need that kind of uh, I mean, detail? If you're me, but maybe that's not the most entertaining thing to Everyone, watch. stand by. <laughs> we're going to organize these books by height. It's going to take all night. So get comfy. No, you stay there. No, stay there. Okay, get all these together. Oh, P Ninja notes that you can zoom. Oh, oh yeah, if you yeah. use the directional pad up and down, it looks like you can zoom in. Oh, I think this is a Tamagotchi. That is a Tamagotchi. Oh, this is a desk. Thank you, P Ninja, for the tip. Oh, I yes. I didn't know that this was a desk. We are learning <laughs> things. Put that there. These things go there. And there's a drawer there. Oh my goodness. We are, we just opened up a whole new level I, of gameplay. My mind is blown. Now we know. Now we know. Okay, we got our games there. Um, where is this gonna go now? Oh, Scarlet Unicorn says, caught the VOD for the first half of lunch crafting last week. And I declared multiple times how peaceful it was, and it was nothing like the week before, and then I got blown up a bunch. So yeah. I, I, I brought it on myself. I cursed myself. So if I say, you know, this game is really peaceful, perhaps the house will, will burn down or something. We'll find out. No. Hello. Ooh, look at this guy. This is a large dude. Okay, go hey, buddy. Back. Ooh, that looks like a poster. Is that like... Oh, yeah. All right. Uh... Oh, that like looks like a trapper keeper. Right here? I like it. Who there. made that? Who made those that art? That style? Oh, Lisa Frank? Lisa Frank. That's it. That looks like a, that's a, looks like a Lisa Frank original. Another book. Is that the Final Fantasy Chocobo Tamagotchi? No, that's a, that's a, a Timmy Gucci. It's a completely original thing. I think you got a Game Boy. I, wait, yes, we do have a Game Boy. Oh, do you not have room for that book? Did you fill up fill the bookshelf? Well, just not. Little book. There's no room for you. Will you not go in here all the, now the entire system is ruined. We're done. We game over. Game over. Reset the room. Can I move the shelf? No, I can't. Burning the house shelf. down. Start over. Yep. Well, I guess that's okay. I, I don't like it, but. Ooh, camera. Oh. What's that? You press X. Oh, we got thing. Make some memories. Oh. Oh, you use photo uh, mode. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not ready to do I'm this. I'm gonna pose. Yet. Wait till wait till we get rid of the boxes. Okay. On the floor. Terrible game, zero out of ten. Do not recommend. Ah, I can't. Another book. Too many books. Too many books. It's our nemesis. Another book. What a ducky. Oh, his sunglasses. Oh, he's cool. That's the coolest duck I've ever seen. Book mid boss. Yes. This is the boss battle. He's getting all these books on his shelf. Why can't you pack all your books in the same place? Now there are too many things up there. Now he can't sleep up there. This now. is definitely Animal Crossing now. Yep. 
There's all our oh, villagers. There's all we got Piggy. We got Cool Ducky. Uh, we got Excited Frog. I don't know what that is. Tapes? Big Eyed Dragon. Tapes. And Kitty Engineer. Those are our friends. More books. No more. I, all the books. Uh, no, oh. no. Uh, what about that three ring one? That's like, maybe that's a diary. Maybe that doesn't belong there. Oh, does it say it can go in there? What is happening? What is, what is it telling Everyone me to do? Should pick that up. It's like outlining, but it's outlining. I think it wants there. you to grab that one. That one that's blinking. I had it. No, the one on the shelf. The one on the shelf is blinking. Yeah, that one. This one? That pink one. Yeah, I see, that's a diary. Oh, maybe it's telling you that doesn't go there. Maybe the diary guy goes on the desk. Because you got to write in it. Let's try to get the writer's cramp out in procedure now. It still doesn't like that. Okay, we'll stay here. Uh, what do I... I got too much stuff up here. Can we zoom in on the diary? Maybe we can open that up? Well, it's locked. We don't have I think key. it wants maybe to me to put it somewhere. Oh, it could we go got in a there. lot of space in here. You could store some stuff in there. Can you hide it under the mattress? Asked Scarlet Unicorn. Or under the, the pillow? Oh, under the pillow. I want me to put it in here. Oh, you think you go in the drawer? Now it's yelling at me. It doesn't want any of those things on the floor. It's not happy with that. Okay, well, I like that. Oh, there we go. A diary goes in there. Okay. Well, you can put those in the cabinet. Do you put those in the cabinet? Um. It just wants you to pick stuff off the floor. Oh. It's sloppy. That's fine. So we got scissors. Can I put that in there? I cannot put that Classic in there. Classic 97 diary hiding spot. Oh. It's good. We got a star. I don't think it's good. Still feels messy. Too many things. All right. Okay, but I will stop. We got the star. Can you click it? Into my book. Finally, my own room. Beginning. Unpacked 1997. Oh, we're jumping ahead. Oh, this looks like a dorm room. It's a very large computer monitor. Just there. So we've aged. Oh, that looks like a concert poster. Classic. Classic dorm room concert poster. Oh, look at that computer! Look at the size of that thing! Oh, wait, I didn't even notice the monitor on the desk. Oh, yeah, I see a very large monitor. Oh, wow. Classic. 2004 coffee shop background music. Yeah. Mr. Pig! Mr. Pig made it. Mr. Pig made it to college with us. Toothbrush. Oh, uh, what's this? Oh, look. Oh, look, right above me. It says right button. Oh, wait. Um. Like your like trigger button. Oh. Oh, we got another we room. Got a bed. Oh, you keep we, going. We you got keep, our own bathroom. You can keep going. At the, like at our dorm. Look at this. Little kitchen. We've got many things. All right, let's start here. We have to. Oh, boy. All right, I'm going to put the bathroom stuff on the floor. Oh. oh, look at the little wooden guy. Someone likes to draw. Can probably, we pose him? Probably. I'm pretty sure everybody had this boombox. Oh my gosh, look at that boombox. <laughs> Where did y'all find my old PC, says Scarlet Unicorn. <laughs> right here in this box. That's where it's been. Was that pants? Pants. Got 
I have pants. Andy's continuing story. Yes, where Toy Story 3 ends. We pick up right here. Oh, we only packed one shoe. That seems foolish of us. As you know. There you go. This is my guest room, says P Ninja. Oh, Docs. Very stylish person here. The drawer can Docs hold exactly one pair of pants. That's true. <laughs> Maybe I can move them over. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. Unmentionables. Unmentionables. Put that <laughs> away. Put that away. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. There's more. I'm not looking. Put that away. Let's put them together. I guess that makes sense. We'll have the unmentionables drawer. Nope. Come here. This is a family stream. There we go. Get your underwear off the floor. Oh, oh. Ooh, a black one. <laughs> Getting fancy. I mean, it's getting crazy in here. There we go. Oh, come here. Warcry Mango says that's actually a bow tie. Three very large bow ties. Oh, we got like space poster. What's that? It looks like a Game Boy. Oh, we got Engineer Cat. Also came with us to college. Can you can you zoom in on the Game Boy? I want to see it. Side. Oh, that's a... Wow. Cool. Nah. Oh, it's sideways. I was thinking, like, how do you hold that? There you go. Yeah, that's a Game Boy. That's like Game Boy Color. Mochi Puddle says, this is so satisfying to watch. It is. There's something very satisfying about seeing all the stuff go into nice places. Just putting it in its place. Very chill, yes. Oh, I'm getting excited seeing all this old stuff. An accordion folder. Have we uncovered a Maroon 5 CD yet? Possibly. We have a CD set up there. There's multiple things in it. Maroon 5 might be there. Oh. What's that? Pick up the pants. Pick up your pants. What's that, socks? It's either socks or other unmentionables. Socks or unmentionables. I think it's unmentionables. Oh, yep. Look, they're all in little balls. Someone's been watching Marie Kondo. Yes. Marie Kondo, she likes to roll everything up in little balls. Uh, well, you're going in the kitchen. You've got pants? Leave you here. We're rolling them into a little ball. As long as they, they spark joy. Work at Mango says, someone nicely folds their things, and it isn't me. Yes. This person is very organized. Got the Rubik's Cube. Another little ball. I think now we're in socks. But we've only got the two drawers. Normally I wouldn't mix, but you know, we only got the two drawers. Oh, hello. Oh, dance. No, Can I we hang it on the hold it? I was yeah, I was trying to hang it. Oh, there we go. Ooh, dance shirt. Scarlet Unicorn says, okay, this box has all of my underwear and the toaster. Ship it. <laughs> well, you use the underwear to pack it, so, you know, as packing material for oh, the toaster. Oh, that's right. It's use like, what we you got. We don't want the toaster to get damaged. Let's fill it with underwear. Oh, what is that's this? That's fine. Oh, this is like colored pencils. Yeah, I don't think this person is uh, likes to draw. Yeah, they got the little artist guy. And they got the eraser. Markers. It looks like pens. those are like markers. Okay, I have to figure out how to, where to put these books. My nemesis books. Nemesis books. Is a toaster unmentionable? The toaster is shy. Shy toaster. Where do the boxes go? You click them and they just vanish. Don't they know we could be building a fort? We could be building a fort. What a fort. I got too much stuff up here now. Yeah, this, this desk is... Uh, I don't know how you're going to have computing and drawing on the same desk, especially with that old monitor. That is where? a beefy monitor. Well, can I just... Can I hang this? Yeah, it's oh, a can't picture. Hang. A, a monkey. Okay. All right. Can we zoom in on the picture? I want to see it. Yes, it is a monkey. And like a Pokemon girl? 
Yeah. Kind of looks like Eevee, but person. Oh, well, there's the mouse. <laughs> Phoenix just thinking about the crumbs. Our underwear has, has breadcrumbs now. <laughs> Comes with breadcrumbs. Is that a mouse pad? Yeah, that's a mouse pad. Oh, wait, yep. Go on there. Mouse goes on the mouse pad. We haven't found the keyboard yet. Oh, no, I gotta make room for that. Yep. Running out of room for these Rubik's books. Rubik's Cube, you don't belong there. Books need to go there. Get away. Stay there. Get on the bed. Yeah, just throw it on the bed. The crumbs in the underwear. <laughs> Welcome to the Zeppelin Cafe, where we make you think about the crumbs in your underwear. Why do we always pack rulers? Well, I think, you know, we're an artist. We need the rulers. That's what I think. Yeah. And eventually there will be lots, many kinds of rulers. Mochi points out it's better than thinking about salmonella. That's true. No, we haven't found any salmonella in these boxes yet. Oh, I think this is an iPod. It took me way too long to figure out what is this. Our college student did not pack raw chicken for the trip to college. We got the, uh, got the flannel shirt. There's another shirt. I didn't see what's on that one. Like, a person. Like a missing person's poster? Have you seen this person? They're on my shirt. On this episode of Adulting, we learn desks are never big enough. I'm running out of hangers. I'm already feel like I'm going to be upset. Oh, well, we got a little doodad. Oh, that was the toy from the room. Yeah, we took a few. We brought a few toys. More pants. Oh, we brought our old soccer ball. So we like art and soccer. Oh, oh no. Shirt. No. Well, you can fold it. No, the, they have to fold the other shirts. Oh, no. <laughs> See, and now everything's okay. all over the place. This just will not do. Oh, can I put that there? Oh, nice. But, nope. Fine. We have to move them one at a time <laughs> into quarter. Okay. Nope. There. All right. We're being judged. Oh, we got that the hoodie. You want to hang that up? The clock. Well, that's good right there. Oh, we have to set it. Oh yeah, it's, it's set to the same time as my watch. I'm missing what's on these shirts. That's ruffled. That one's ruffled. That's a fancy one. What's that? Oh, it's a little it's toy a double car. decker bus. Oh, I, okay. So she's been to to London. London and, Paris. and and in the or the first room we had the double decker bus, so she went to Paris in, in between at some point. Scarlet Unicorn says it was a nice, calm game until the hangar incident, and then everything fell apart. Yeah, that's just me. Do we? I think we only have the one Doc Martin. One shoe. I never lived in the dorms, but I assure you, it would not have been this neat. Nope, nope. Get, stay there. Oh, those are jammies. Stay there. Yeah, those are jammies. Those, those are jammy jammy jammies. Oh, I think this is jammies, too. Oh, yeah, that's the top. Okay. We'll put those together. No, that does not go in there. Where did that come that from? That is like more underwear. I thought we packed all our underwear with the toaster. <laughs> Apparently not. Get there. Hey. The dog must have gotten the other shoe. Yep. But we brought the one to remember. All right, this better be the last unmentionable because now I don't got any room. Okay, oh, that's unmentionable. Paper. Another what book. Is this? Maybe oh, that's. Oh, maybe that's a bathroom me. book. Because it was with the toilet paper. I, oh, oh, well, oh you I can, can put, put under that the pillow. Under, that looks like a sketchbook, so we'll. Yeah, you better sleep with your sketchbook. Hey, yeah, pretty much. Oh wait, this is our. Oh, that's our like fancy book. Oh, that's yeah, that's the book we took a picture of. You can't stack, stack any more shirts. <laughs> we'll just stack this on top of the jammies. No, that's not gonna. We gotta that's move not them now. Happen. We're doing this right, but we're not doing it at all. Oh, 
Phew. I was worried. I was wondering how you were going to get out of that one, Captain. That was a sticky situation. This is intense. Put a pair of pants. That should be enough of that. All right. Okay, Got close it. your underwear drawer. Uh, <laughs> nope, don't pick up the underwear. I still only have the one shoe. So, we gotta go on a hunt and rescue for the other shoe. And you, I guess you can bring your, your bathroom stuff. Uh, yes. Go put your toaster in the bathroom. Okay. Oh, there's a box in here. Yeah, let me go get my... Maybe uh, there's a shoe. Toothpaste. Are we sure it's toothpaste? It's a two. Could be ointment. Well, either way, it should be in here. Oh, look, you hung it! Yeah. And you hung it the right way. That's a towel. And that is soap. They pack. She packs soap. I mean, I probably would have just bought a new bar of soap. Can I put the toothbrush in there? That's her favorite bar of soap. There we go. She brought it from home. Here, actually, oh. Did you just put the toothbrush in the cup? Uh-huh. Wow. This game yeah, I got a lot of space. Oh, deodorant. Oh, uh, no, that's Can right. we open, can we open the cabinet? Yeah, that was just a website. say, like, no. No. Like we could open the lower cabinet. If we get, like, cleaning supplies, maybe. Nope. This is my lucky soap. Yes. She has a hyper, hypoallergenic brand of soap. That's right, it's hard to find. She had to import it from Paris. That's where she first found it. So she had to bring it with her. This doesn't go in here. What did that do in there? Oh, other unmentionables. We'll just, we'll just put those underneath. Back. This is not enough counter space for a bathroom. No. Welcome to the dorm. We don't care. Mochi says, my counter is equally as small. Oh, no. Aww. Well, we're going to show you, Mochi, how to make the most of your counter space. How to Jenga all your stuff. Yeah. B Ninja says, we need more seashells. This doesn't go well. I don't. I don't think she knows how to use the seashells. You don't know how to use the seashells? Nope. Okay. Uh... Do we want to leave all this stuff here? Do we want to leave a frying pan on the floor? <laughs> well, there's a drain in here. Huh. Okay. I think that works. First aid. Uh, I don't think I can get the toilet paper in there. But it seems happy up there. I mean, that seems a fine place for toilet paper. It's where you're going to need it. Okay, let's... Uh... I put toilet paper there. Let's leave that there. Weird that there's a drain on the floor when there's a tub. It's for... It's for overflowing tub parties. Okay. What do we got? We got a mug? Mug. Is there a medicine cabinet behind the mirror? We don't think so. We tried to do I that. I tried to open it. I will try again because we have to go back in. It seemed like, yes, you should be able to open that. But it didn't. I think it was just a mirror. I think the college cheaped out on us. Although we have a kitchen. So, that's wild. I got under sink. Oh, divider. Oh, we gotta put all the little silverware in there. Um, yeah, I think we're good so far. We got a bowl. You got a bowl? Good for you. Miss Matt, please. This hey, we found the here. keyboard! I knew it had to be somewhere. Keyboard with the plates. Oh, that looks like a proper Coke glass. Oh yeah, that's like a that's like a classic Coca-Cola glass. Oh no, wait, everything's different. It's a it's a Coca-Cola glass. Oh. Delicious Coca-Cola. Just there. Wait right. a moment while I figure out what is happening. Little sponge, little scrubby sponge. Oh, I like that. It's got a little uh, bumpers to meet sunglasses. I think that's an electric kettle. I don't think so. I think you're right. Hey, it's our well, shoe. There's the other shoe. The uh, shoe made it. I don't know 
what that is. That's a bottle opener. Bottle okay. opener? Bottle opener and a can opener? Yeah. An odd selection of glasses. It's just whatever it's whatever mom and dad didn't want. That's what you get to bring to college. I love reaching into a box and finding random knives. <laughs> yeah. Also packing your shoe with like your plates? Yeah. Yeah. That uh, seems fine. Maybe it's a new shoe. Maybe she bought it for college. She hasn't worn it yet. All right, let's we go can with hope. that. Because otherwise I'm a little grossed out. The way she packs makes me a little twitchy. Yes. Oh, this is a paper towel. There's not it's much. There's a little bit of organization. And then sometimes it's just, hey, I got to put this shoe somewhere in the box. Uh, is that out measuring later. spoons or spoon spoons? I think um, I'm going to go with spoon spoons. All right. Oh, but we can zoom in. Let's zoom in and look at the spoons. Do I have a hook? Here we go. I think spoon spoons. Yeah, I think spoon spoons. Perfect. And fork forks. No, upright. right. Thank you. Okay, butter knives. Yeah, let's put that away, Michael Myers. Not pointing towards us. Oh, wait. At least it didn't Other... give you individual I... spoons. Yes. <laughs> That's for the hard level later. I think this is measuring spoons. You won't go in there? Maybe there's spoons. More spoons. Maybe there's little spoons. You got big spoons and little spoons. Yep. Come here. Phoenix just says, make sure not to wash any of that after being in a box with your boot. We're, we're hoping it's a new boot. No, I think that's cleaner. Oh, that's like, yeah, for dishwasher. Oh my gosh, they got dishwasher. This is a great dorm. Was that bug spray? Bug spray. Oh, like a, uh, like a panini press, I think? A panini press? I think so. Not How fancy we are. We brought our panini press to college. New or not, I'm going to need a wash of fork that's been chilling with my shoe. <laughs> yeah, that's probably a good idea. But you know what? We're in college! We don't care about such things. Oh, there's a hook. You can hang something. It's on the oh, wall. Oh, I do see a hook. All right. Uh, yeah, and this has a little hook. There we go. Can I put the stock pot there? I don't think it's one with a boat. We're just going to store all of our pots directly on the stove. Oh, that is olive oil. Uh. Sure. What's that? Plastic wrap? Garbage bags? I think garbage sense. bags. I don't know what that is at all. Let's zoom in on it. Extra sponges. Oh, extra sponges. Scarlet Unicorn asks, can you put stuff on the very, very top of the cabinets? Like on the black area. Oh, that's a good, good idea. Oh, good. We're like, done. Oh, yes, yes, you're yelling at around. me. I understand. There we go. Ooh, you need me press up there. Good thought. Okay. I doubt that's something we use all the time, so we can put it up there. So the wooden spoon's unhappy. Oh, wait. Oh, the, the wooden spoon. Yeah. Maybe it goes in the drawer. You need a spoon holder. Now it's happy. Okay. So the salt. Um, well. Let's put the cat. Let's put the towels way at the top. <laughs> well, I'm making room for the that. You want that out? You're gonna use that a lot. Yeah. It says, oh, is that a mini fridge or a dishwasher? That's. I thought it was a dishwasher. Maybe it's oh, a fridge. Oh, that's what I thought. Can we open it? Uh, it doesn't seem. Whoa. Well, our shoe's in the way. In a pot. Still don't know. No, I can't. I, we yeah. cannot store anything in the fridge. But I think it is a fridge. It's got a little handle. Okay. Let's evaluate. Okay, let's just stop and think. <laughs> let's take a moment. <laughs> I'll take all this it's like a mystery this. Machine. There is only one mystery machine, and it carries Scooby-Doo. Can I put 
put you there. I can't put you there. Pick up the stack. When I put you there, I can't put you there. Plates on the floor. I think we need a mug rack. That would help a lot. Can we go to video game Ikea and buy some useful things for storage? We have too many mugs. This is too many mugs. Oh, Scarlet Unicorn says put all the mugs over the microwave. Yeah, I think that's smart. That is. That's a good place for mugs. You're probably going to be heating them up. Oh, this there. mismatched collection of mugs that she's probably collected, you know, from from nice times in her life. Oh. They mean something. Come here. Give her the feels. Glass. Nope. No? Yeah. Alright. There's our other glass. Now, if we can figure out where those towels go, we'll be in good shape. Towels do not go there. Here? Oh, yeah, right yeah. next to the sink. Okay. That'll work. I feel like they're gonna get wet, but. Whatever. You, you do you. Now if we can just get that pot off the floor. We'll be in good shape in here. Nope. Oh, it's stuck. Come here. There's a pot in the way. Oh, well, I, you know what? I'll just put it on top. Hopefully we're not short. I mean, we got it up there. All right. Now let's get uh, the rest of this stuff out of here. Shoe go over here. It already doesn't like this. It doesn't like where you've put your shoes. No, it likes where that one pair of shoes is. Can I, what? Oh, you've got a- Oh, no, no, no. You've got a little space, like up there, under the uh, the clock, right next to the bed. You can put Let's something there. Let's see if I can put the shoes in here, but they probably won't fit. Oh, they will. Nope. They do fit. Yes? Okay. Oh, put your book bag right here under the, under the clock. Over by the- Oh, plate. oh yeah, there we go. It's there. That's fine. It's a book bag. Perfect. Soccer ball. And a little pig. That'll work. Oh, it doesn't like it being under the pillow. No. You're killing me. You're killing me. Can you put the special book under there? No. <laughs> well, what about the, the... Can you put the plush toys up there on the bed? And then you have another shelf. Oh, I guess they're happy there. Those books. I oh, there you go. Do, I was just gonna do this. That works. Yeah, in case you want to put yourself to sleep. No, no, it still doesn't want... You got the Rubik's Cube. Doesn't want the soccer ball on the floor. Seems Can it go on top of the... Very oh, picky. they're perfect. Soccer ball... Dirty soccer ball right next to the jammies. Uh, these are pencils. Can they go in that space under the clock? With the books? That looks like a sketchbook, the spiral one. Yeah, it does. No. Oh, there's a drawer there. I'm silly. Okay. Oh, what about your, um... Oh, yeah, you can clear off some of the desk space. What a surprisingly involved game. It is like a puzzle element. <laughs> it is. It's like it's like playing a very slow game of Tetris. Can they go in the desk? In here? Really? They're huge. Oh, you should put um. your iPod by the clock. Because, you know, maybe she wants to listen to some music as she goes to sleep. I can't put that there because... All right, we'll put that there. Now we'll just uh, find a home for the toaster. We gotta go get the keyboard. Oh, we'll swap. Well, oh, sit there. Okay. 
I hope we don't want toast too often. Oh, dang. Colored pencils. You're messing with us. No, go next to it. Next to it. Do you notice how there's no under the bed? The yeah. bed goes all the way to the floor. They, they got us. They knew it. Because that would have been that would have been my thing. Throw it all under there. You go there. You go there. I, should I point out the problem you've just created? What? Oh, you know, that the, the tower is all the way on that side. Yes, there, you, you see, know. your chair is on the right, and the monitor is on the left. I can't move the... <laughs> and the chair does not Why move. Why can't I just move it? No. Due to new college regulations, we have glued the chairs to the floor. <laughs> the chair is bolted to the ground. Okay, how Can the far? red cassette looking thing on the top shelf fit in the rack on the bottom shelf? Are we right handed or are we left handed? Oh, the Game Boy. Well, it seems happy. Work Grand Mango says the game doesn't mind. That's true. That's why I said I don't know if I should point this out. Because the game didn't care. You know what? We're just doing that. Color pencils. Everything's fine. Oh, no. Leave that there. Uh, something doesn't like something in the bathroom. What the, oh, right. Oh, oh, you left that on the <laughs> Unmentionable. floor. Unmentionable. Get that back. Open that closet. Look, you brought just the right amount. But it fits in the bottom drawer. Look how nice and neat that is. We took a picture of our chair. Remember college and oh, our my, chair? Oh, my pillow's all messed up. Oh, you left the pillow on. <laughs> oh, well. Jump ahead three more years. Oh, my. Oh, wait, before we get going, mm -hmm. should we take a little break? We can take a break. Yes, let's take a little break. This looks interesting. Apparently, we are, we are into cosplay. I want to see what else is in these boxes. Also have many game controllers. Oh yes, this is gonna be interesting. But after the break, we're gonna take a little break, just a couple minutes, and we'll be right back to explore these other rooms that we have just discovered. Stay tuned. Get my break button.
right, we're back. We got a few drinks. You know, I got a little water. Feeling good. Captain, did you get a drink? I did get a drink. All right. And we're ready to learn more about our our person who moves every few years. We found that we had the bedroom. We had the college. And now, maybe first apartment? Yeah, that sounds... I think that feels right. It said yeah. it was... Uh, I think it was three years mm. since the uh, the college and moving to the dorm. So that was freshman. So yeah, we're still in college. We're assuming. Oh yeah, look. That uh, button at the top is flashing. You press Y. Oh, there's the apartment. This is our apartment. Oh, we got a lot of rooms. We got we got a lot this of work. A big to do apartment. Here. All right. Oh, worker and mango said this is relaxing to watch. It is. But at the same time, I'm getting like very excited. Like, put that over there. Where's the shoe? Oh, that has a little bit of a puzzle element to it. Yeah. It's it's relaxing and exciting at the same time. And we have these relaxing. two. Relaxing. We have these two games here. What do we think these are? Azores? Monopoly is capital, possibly? Capital, yeah, capitalism. Yep. And the Azores. I don't know. If anyone's Let's... got an idea, let us know. Oh. This lady has followed us all the way. That's our favorite toy. It's like, She's uh... like a Power Ranger or something. Yep. Well, clearly we're like, you know, fans of Sailor Moon. That's what that outfit looks like yeah. to me. What Sailor Scout is that? Saturn? Yeah, I don't know. Who the uh orange? That was uh that was uh, Venus. Venus was Venus orange. Venus was orange. Yes. Big fans of Sailor Venus. Actually, you come out here. I wanna see you. Scarlet Unicorn says there's already stuff in here. Maybe we have a roommate. That's true, maybe we're not fans of Sailor Venus. Maybe our roommate is. And that's who's building the the cost, because we haven't seen that we've been interested in uh in making costumes or sewing or anything well we had all the art supplies we did so that could be uh fashion design maybe our roommate is actually sailor venus yes we figured out the twist in this game she wouldn't be around much i think sailor moon's on the bookshelf can we zoom in right under the cd player i mean i think that's her oh i can't interact with it no because it's not yours I'll bet it's the roommates. I'll bet that's right. The roommate who is into the roller derby, according to this poster. Mango says it looks like Chun Li. It could be. Maybe it's Sailor Chun Li. What is that a picture of? Zoom into that. Is that like a D and D campaign? Maybe fantasy. Maybe it's their favorite anime. Oh, controller. What about the other controller? Ooh, oh, uh, oh a we got a cube. GameCube or a game. We got two Hot controllers. We got a blue controller and a pink controller. Oh, that's a game. Let's put the games together. Let's zoom in. Zoom in on the games. Oh, that's a PS2. That is definitely a PS2. And three controllers, and you're bringing in the GameCube. Oh, blanket. Yeah, those those are GameCube boxes. There's no question. Killing me. All right. What is this? Is this on the floor? Okay. All by right. By the evil, by moonlight. Uh, we love by daylight. Let's bring the pot into the kitchen. Brought a pot into the living room because we're really bad at packing boxes. We have a lock. GameCube boxes should have been squares. Well, you know, they were a lot closer to squares in Japan. And then they just went with like regular DVD cases here because I think it was just probably easier. Oh, I see a French press. Someone is classy. Work Grand Mango says play Path of Radiance. Play in Fire Emblem. We got the GameCube. Fire it up. You know, I'll bet if we looked at those GameCube boxes, I'll bet they are colored just enough that we can figure out what games they are. Do they have Resident Evil, on the, Resident Evil Zero on the GameCube? Classic. 
Hello, roommate, with all of your matching stuff. Here are all my mismatched mugs. That's true, look at this. Look at the roommate's stuff. Somebody cares about their plates and glasses. We made ours ourselves. In the shop glass. What is that? Is that a magnet? Oh, it's a fridge magnet. It's a koala bear. Still haven't changed the way we pack knives. No, we don't even wrap them or anything. Just throw it in a box. Let's make this more realistic and assume they move back in with their parents. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> Could be. Maybe she dropped out of college. Although, I don't know, with the uh, Sailor Venus sitting in the living room, I'm, I'm voting roommate. Yeah, mom is in the Sailor Moon. I mean, it could be. Maybe mom is Sailor Venus. Oh, this game's getting interesting. Now in the next level, we will have a fight with the roommate and our stuff will be thrown out on the lawn and we have to repack it back into the boxes and find a new place to live. <laughs> is our name Serena? Yes, it might be. This is how Serena met Sailor Venus. Because Sailor Venus very sloppily had her outfit out in the living room and revealed her secret identity. Next level, you and roommate have to try to remember who owned what. Well, you get the matching glasses. I get the colorful mugs. I think this is your salt. That's my knife. Just throw it anywhere. It's fine. To the left. To the left. Everything you own in a box to the left. <laughs> <laughs> pretty good. We just got our uh, stuff that needs to go in the bathroom. Oh, is that a towel? It's a towel. It's a towel. There we go. Oh, perfect. Uh, let's go get our first aid kit. Might, might belong in the kitchen. I, it was in the bathroom before. It was, but I'm thinking of how you pack your knives. We got a washing machine in there. Alright. Crush. Just put it in the same cup that your roommate drinks out of. That's like their cup that they probably wash their mouth after they brush their teeth and you just stuck your toothbrush in it. Flux. Big old thing of flux. Nail clippers. Give me your brush. Oh, a little like caboodle. A little toiletry kit. Enormous, enormous Perk Plus. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It's a big old bottle of Perk Plus. See, they uh, they know someone who has like a Costco membership, so they went over there, got themselves a big old thing of Perk Plus. It's gonna last them all the rest of college. Oh, and like us. Cleaner? I think that's for like spritz in the air. Oh, like Maybe a... you should put that on top of the toilet. There we go. Yep. Okay. We just got... It doesn't that seem to be box. yelling at me that that's on the floor. It doesn't but... seem to care. No. But that, we just left that there. What a wonderful window view into your bathroom. Oh my gosh. I didn't notice that. Oh, we have a... Oh, look at that! Oh, we finally got a medicine cabinet. We're moving up in the world. But I'm focused on that window. If this was a sitcom, that's the wacky neighbor be coming up. Knock, knock, knock. Hello? It's your crazy neighbor. Looking in your bathroom. 
Oh, here's oh, our space. Here's all the stuff. Here's our oh, space. Oh, we graduated to a flat. Bow. There we go. Hi, Tom. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> We're moving on up to the east side. Is this like a drawing? To a oh, okay. Here shared room apartment in the sky. Maybe in the sky. Mochi says, I used to live in a place that had a window in the shower. It was really big and low, too. Okay. Oh my gosh, that sounds terrible. I can't. I couldn't do it. There would just be a wet towel just hanging in front of that window all the time. So we seem to have collected more art supplies. Mm-hmm. Oh, are those business cards? Oh, maybe. I bet that's what those are. Oh, there's our favorite sketchbook. We have a few of them now. Um, there's our clock. Don't have a bedside table. Oh, man, that's a downgrade. Even the dorm had a bedside table. Oh, did we open our closet? Not open the closet. Well, we got some hangers. Hangers. And some shoes. We got some drawers. Okay. That's handy. Oh, wait. That's like staying at a hotel kind of closet. Oh, come here. We ran out of window screens, so we improvised with chain link fencing. Yeah. Okay, we have a hat. Yeah, that's appealing. Get up in the morning and just take a nice look out of your chain link fence. Not at all like you're in a prison. We gotta put all our little underwear, little underwear balls. Oh, there's our photo book. It's good to see you, photo book. But back to the underwear balls. Can't wait to find an appliance in there. Yep. <laughs> What's it gonna be? <laughs> what is it gonna be? Will it be an electric kettle? Maybe a toaster? Maybe the George Foreman grill? Stay tuned. Already too many shoes. And none of them go together. No. <laughs> Just three mismatched shoes. Oh, these are not. Well, we know for sure what the other shoe is going to be somewhere else. We don't like well, to pack we them together. We the kitchen and we didn't find the other shoes. <laughs> we have a weird, weird packing style where we think it's bad luck to put the shoes together. Pants. Oh, wait, you sit there for a second. Oh, there's our missing person shirt. We still haven't found him all these years later. We still got the shirt. We're not giving up the search. Gary Poorman Grill, you mean? Oh, That's right. Actually. It's distinctly different in every way. Our hoodie. Another sketchbook. Man, we've taken on a lot of sketchbooks. Yeah, that happens. <laughs> Wish I, I could do my laundry with point and click. Like yeah. That would be nice. They make it seem so simple. Oh, look at. Oh, zoom in on that. In the in the drawer. Oh, we've upgraded. The idea. Those are Game Boy Advance. Game Boy Advance. Those are advanced Game Boy Advance games. Oh, this was? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a bunch of Game Boy Advance Whoa. games. Let's put those together. We finally got rid of that old Game Boy Color. It's Game Boy Advance and GameCube time. Pig. Oh, Mr. Pig. Hello, Mr. Pig. We're very glad you joined us. It wouldn't be a room without Mr. Pig. That's just another 
randomly placed ball of underwear? Yeah, I think so. Or socks, perhaps? Oh, yeah, it's folded different. I think those are socks. Oh, Mochi still has the Game Boy Advance. Might be a little broken, though. Those things were, those things were so tough. Seems like they could take anything. Nintendo really made really hardy stuff back then. And that's the same clock from college we never learned how to set. Hey, it's right twice a day. And that's good enough. Don't think I have another skirt hanger. That's upsetting. Nope. You can hang pants or you can hang skirt. But you can't hang both. Now we're gonna find a third skirt, just watch. Oh, we have a Wacom tablet. Oh, Wacom tablet. We're a serious artist. Oh, there's the mouse pad. Oh man, that means the computer's gonna be somewhere. So I don't know where to put this clock. You could put it on all the way on the top of the desk. Yeah, if the alarm goes up, you're gonna yeah. have to work for it. <laughs> See, that's it. You got if you want to wake stop that alarm, you gotta climb up on that chair and turn that alarm off. Now this is a problem where you have to have the mouse and the Wacom and uh Hey, at least we've got a better computer right. monitor. Yep, no, never room for all three things. What if we move the, iP the iPod? Or the... Well, yes, technically, the, but... It, the J-Pod. Whatever it is. A distinctly different music listening device. Heck, I'm just gonna say it's a Zoom. I think that's fine. I can say it's a Zoom. We're playing this on the Xbox. Maybe it's an Etch-A-Sketch, you know? I kind of thought it might have been a Magna Doodle at first. You're not gonna let me stack these, are you? Can I can stack them oh, here. Oh, they are. Well, I meant on top of the other one. Oh, no. Oh, there's poster. Oh, there's that space poster. Out here. We got jeans. We got more jeans. Uh, frisbee? frisbee? Well, okay. yeah, we're in college. Ultimate Frisbee. Is that a water shoe? Maybe. Uh, sure. I, I don't know. If we find another. Oh, yeah, yeah, some kind of sneaker. I don't know what this is. It's. Some kind of a bag? Uh, I have no idea. We'll just put it's you going there. in the closet. If anyone can identify the mystery bag, please let us know. I think it's like a purse. I think. 2007 was a strange time. Yeah. Oh, there's our book bag. I'll deal with the clothes in a second. Well, it's not yelling at us. Well, it will once I get towards the end. Oh, okay. Once you clear all the boxes, it's gonna be like, get those clothes off the bed. Oh, well, that goes and in say, the well, kitchen. You'll say, well, I'll just oh. sleep under it. Yoga mat? Also, no good place for the yoga mat ever. Well, now we have an under the bed. We are not making enough use of under the bed. Everything can just go under there. I say pile it all on top of the bed and then just move the pillow. Okay, we're, we're gonna have to deal with this now. Maybe a sleeping bag. Oh, that could be. We gotta start dealing with these shirts and pants. The blue ones are clearly the bananas in pajamas. They're coming down the stairs. I'll pick up the stack. There you go. B Ninja says we graduated college just to buy out a Nordstrom. Yep. I'm 
feeling like we haven't graduated yet. There's a diploma. Oh, is there? I'm assuming that's what this is. I mean, it makes sense. No, or an award of some kind, I guess. Possibly. So we got out of college in three years. We did good. Well, maybe we didn't move out right away from our parents' house. That's true. We could have moved into the dorm in like sophomore year. I don't think I have another hanger. So. Oh, don't worry. You have an entire box you haven't opened yet. I know. Big stack. Which can double as a table. Oh, there's our trash can. One fa Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. That's a waste of time. Oh, oh, Pete Ninja says in the non-US, many have three-year programs. That's true. We don't know what country we're in. Oh, the big box was just the computer. That's all? Okay. That makes sense. Will you sit somewhere? I think it wants to go where that hat is. Oh, that's a waste of space. But I think they, they used to build stuff like that in desks. There, now the okay. computer can overheat in that tight little space. Okay, well, oh, I got this. Put that over here. Over there. Uh, that is an apron. Oh, P Ninja thinks we're somewhere in Europe. They referenced uni and had the mm. washing machine in the bathroom. And it could be. We're going to have to watch for clues. Watch for context clues to figure okay. out I think that's where the heck we are. There. Got these shoes. Definitely had a desk like that. Yeah. Oh, that was like the only type of desk they made back then. Make sure you have a little cubby that's exactly the right size for a computer tower to go in. No ventilation. We gotta figure somewhere to put this frisbee. Maybe we should put it. I'm looking at this little green hat. It looks like it has an apple on it. Not I think either. it's a crown. A pumpkin? Pumpkin? It Are matches they like in the apron. Or something? Huh? Oh, possibly. Yes, that makes sense. Oh, maybe oh. it's an apron. Oh, that's the job. Maybe that's. Oh, the... they work at like Starbucks yeah. or something. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's it. Can I hang this? All right, I'm not enjoying this. Pina just hutch was a whisper away from collapsing, <laughs> and there it goes. Crash. Okay. Good luck if you ever need to get to the back of the tower. No one ever needs to get to the back of the tower. That's why they built them that way. Oh, I guess I guess if this is my work thing, I should I don't know where to put it. I guess it's, it needs to be in the bedroom. Well, yeah, it's your clothes. No hangers. Go buy yourself some more hangers. This is ridiculous. Maybe, maybe it's a grocery store because it's got like a, it's an apple or pumpkin or something. On it. Okay, everything seems good. Now we just got the dining room. Uh, we're playing like Yahtzee. It looks like. Driving me crazy with the gloves. So peaceful. Just watching the books. The bowl. Oh, there's a wig all the way at the top. We definitely have a cosplaying roommate. is going to introduce us to the world of anime. Well, look, we had a... Uh, that doll looks anime -ish. That's true, that little toy. That looked very anime. Parrot. Haven't played Yahtzee in years. Don't even remember how to play. I just remember you say Yahtzee. Yes, from oh. what I recall, there we are went dice. To Italy. And you shake them up and you throw them on a the table. And then you scream really loud, Yahtzee! Yep. And if everybody leaves the room because you're so loud, then you win. I think that's how you play. Okay. 
So while you were talking, Wendell, yeah. we missed that we went to Italy at some point. Ooh. We're continuing our tour of Europe. Slowly. Oh, Mr. Kitty. And a chicken. And babies. Oh, there's our mannequin. I don't know if that should go in here, but all right. I think it's more of a decoration. May need to review the rules. Nah. Okay. Oh, we got clothes here. Oh, that's right. It's it's us and our random packing strategy. What don't you like in Scarlet there? Scarlet Unicorn says they don't eat in here. It's the fun nerd room. I think that's true. Just eat in your bedroom. Does not like the shoes there. I'm gonna do something I'm not gonna be happy with. Did you put the shoe on the shelf? Yeah. That's what the game wants. No. No frisbees on the bed. I don't know where to put it. Maybe you could take it to the game room. Or under the bed. Maybe it's a workout type thing. It could go with the weights. There we go. Okay, sure. That's where I keep my frisbee, under the bed. What's that bump in the floor? I didn't see a bump in the floor. What room? I see no bump. Oh, I think, yeah, I think oh, it's yeah. just like from furniture? Oh, it's like where, where previous furniture was. We might have moved the bed. Because yep. that looks like a bed indent. Yep, I'll right? bet it's just like you've moved in and you can see the remnants of the previous owners. Okay, I have a blanket. I guess we'll go put that back in. Or can I just put can it you on throw the it on couch? your bed? Oh, where? Oh, oh just on the good. couch. Just, just get like it off a... the floor. Okay. Wow. We did it. And we got a D and D dice. Well, we had that in the uh... movie nights are gonna be awesome. Now that you're out of that dorm, fellowship. Unpacked 2007. What a year. That's where they carpeted over that outlet that was on the floor. <laughs> yep. Three more years. Oh. Oh, look, we're in like a high rise. We can see a bridge. Mm. And we have proper weights. Thank you. This is very different. This does not look like our style. We have like a scorpion. Scarlet Unicorn says, did we move in with um? Boy, I'm getting that feeling. Oh, I, I saw her little weights, and these look a lot bigger. Maybe she just trained more and she's stronger now. She might have. Weights are expensive. She might have. Oh, but he's got Xbox. Those are Xbox controllers. Those green, you can see those green cases. I got a teeny guitar. That's a ukulele. That is underwear. <laughs> uh, oh, one bed. And ties. Yep. He's a professional. It's a professional business type. Got a lot of ties. And he's at the clock. Oh, he said he's responsible. He's a keeper. He knows how to set the clock. I like the like the smooth jazz. It is. <laughs> like we live in the big city now. Yeah, I'd say so. We are moving oh, up in the world. I think they the job. No more chain link windows for us. We moved in possibly with a stockbroker? That could be. New York! Concrete jungle! Which 
dreams are made of. Or maybe Toronto. We still oh, haven't established where we are. London? <clears throat> Any big city, really. I wonder how Sailor Venus is doing. Still wearing that outfit. All these years later. That's why we moved out. We still brought the Game Boy. I don't remember when the, uh, when the DS happened. <clears throat> with the teeny tiny weights. At least you put them both in the same box. Ooh, purple dress. Fancy. Oh, hold on, hang on. For a night out on the town. Oh, Mr. Still Pig. Rob, Mr. Pig. Put him right on the bed. Scarlet Unicorn says the DS was 2004 to 5. So she just didn't upgrade. She just stuck with the Game Boy Advance. Our boyfriend will love that. That's right. Look at this, like, city loft or whatever he's got. And we're gonna come in to his fancy place. Pig on the bed. That's right. No, that's it. And I like there's, uh, there's like no separation of the clothes in the closet. It's just intermingled. One of his, one of hers, one of his, one of hers. He knew what he was signing up for. The pig is part of the deal. You want me, you get the pig. Running out of hangers. Makes the mornings more interesting. Where's my shirt? Where's my shirt? Where's my shirt? Let's grab whatever. This is getting confusing. Just mix it in with his pants. He won't mind. What's mine is yours. That's the deal we made. Oh. I got an extra hanger. Oh, you brought a hanger. One. Just the one. Just brought one hanger. Um, I don't think this is going to help me much. The oh, no. Come here. What's mine is yours except the pig. That's right. Don't touch the pig. Alright. Alright. It's not gonna let me do that. Okay. You just keep hoping it's the last piece of clothing every time. I don't like that there's skirts over here and pants over here. It's upsetting. There's some over there. I think there's some over there. <laughs> oh, there's your work hat. Ooh, there's like his, uh, his briefcase. Let's go through his stuff. He'll love that. We're getting to know him better. This big window here. I can't put this anywhere. What if you close the, uh... There's my yoga close mat. the closet. Maybe there's a place to hang it. It's like a tiny little... It All is right. a teeny little hanger. Maybe next to his ties. Put it next to his ties? Yeah. Nope. Nope, there's clothes hanging down. Can't do it. Maybe by your weights? Oh good, the smooth jazz came back. I was getting worried. Oh, fancy shoe. We own exactly one fancy shoe. Uh, he's like arranged his shoes so that I can. <laughs> that wasn't very thoughtful. <laughs> oh, I can move him. Okay. Oh, you're moving his stuff. Just slightly. This won't end well. Okay. It's gonna be like my shoes need exactly 
four inches of space between. And you ruin that. Oh, Scarlet Unicorn says there might be shoe space under the drawers. That is a good, oh, good idea. Yep. Bingo. Good eye, Scarlet Unicorn. Okay. And you got everything in here except for like our unicorn. Okay, sit there. So you sit there, you will not sit there. He's gonna come home and flip out. Yep. Like, you moved my shoe! It was there! And now it's there! How could you? How could you do it? Oh, fancy toilet. And there's like zero storage in this bathroom. Oh, and he has a, a fancy electric. electric. Oh, toothbrush mug. And it's like mirror that's like bolted to the wall. It's interesting. That's classy. That's how you know. Welcome to my man bathroom, where I don't need shelves or storage because I use exactly three products. Yeah, they're right here. This, and then this. That's it. <laughs> That's all he needs. I have no idea what this is. Oh, maybe that's... Okay. Whoa. Nope. Sand. I think maybe makeup? It might be um, Q-tips, possibly. Oh, yeah. Another shower window. At least this one is probably really high up. So you just gotta worry about the guy in the other building with the telescope. So I just realized this. I, I'm pretty sure I could not move the roommate stuff, but I can move his stuff. Makes sense. <laughs> I can move his stuff around, do whatever I want with it. You know, that, that actually makes sense, though, from a story perspective. Yeah. So let's just place his things. I just put his stuff on the floor, the that's fine, right? <laughs> you don't need all of this. You no. don't need this many shoes. Help them out. Wow, you are like totally destroying his feng shui that he had going on. Sorry, dude. He had like a whole color scheme. Everything was very consistent. Sorry. And then here you come with the pinks and the purples and the greens and the blues. <laughs> Scarlet Unicorn says, my stuff is my stuff, and the roommate's stuff is her stuff. Whereas my stuff is my stuff, and my boyfriend's <laughs> stuff is also my stuff. <laughs> That's part of the dating thing you inherit. You get all of his stuff. Oh, a flat iron. Very nice. She's never had that. Um, I guess I... Whoop. No, maybe we can put it in here. Alright. Does that make space? That doesn't go in here. Maybe it does. Maybe you just want a nice hot panini while you're taking a shower. Close the door. Close the door. It's the trash cans in the way. Oh. You blocked the door. That's fine. All right. Shower panini. Have you ever had a shower panini? True luxury. They like waking up to the smell of fresh bacon sizzling. <laughs> you just set it at night and you can smell it from the bedroom. You'll come running into the bathroom, ready to start your day. Babe, can you pass the cheddar? Oh, no. Oh, this. There we go. Okay. This needs to go over here. Does it though? Oh, look, fancy coffee maker. Look at that. And a simulation of a window. And a magic bullet, apparently. Oh my gosh. Is that the slap chop? No, I think this is a magic bullet. Okay. <laughs> 
I don't think it's a I hope, laptop. I wish it was a slap What is this? Like, the sink is in, like, the island? That's interesting. That's different. Got some bamboo here. Nice. It's a Koorig, says P Ninja. The thing in the back? No, we 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 at Koorig. When did that come about? Are we still too early for the Koorig? No, I think this is a magic bullet. It's the mystical ammunition. <laughs> the mystical ammunition. Oh my god, is that like gold? I get it. Silverware? Oh, open that again. I want to see it. Wow. Fancy. Wow. This nice digital scale. We are dating money. <laughs> Doing pretty good. The very fancy coffee items. Wooden cutting board. Mm hmm. Surely all of our colorful junk is going to fit right in. I'm sure he's going to appreciate all our plastic mixing yep. implements when he has all this like stainless steel. <laughs> Copper pans. Like, that's, that's expensive. Oh, P Ninja would like us to zoom in on the fridge picture. Oh. That's I think us. That's them. Yep. It's like two people hugging. So that was them in happier times before she moved in. He will love our mismatched mugs and pop of color. Uh, so. We are totally not disrupting his life. Okay. So this is. He has a pour over too. This guy he takes his coffee very seriously. I appreciate that. Serious coffee time. That's before he gets home and sees. <laughs> yeah, he's on a business trip right now. He said, here's a key. You go ahead and move in. I'll be home on Friday and we'll celebrate. Just wait till he sees what we've done with the place. Wait till he meets Mr. Pig. Mr. Pig is part of the family. That's right. Yes, don't worry, hon. I'll unpack while you're gone. You won't have to worry about a thing. I got this. Who's that? Is that a laptop? That laptop. And we still have our Wacom. And oh, all that's going to be in the kitchen. I think that goes there. Oh, it's like a whiteboard. Yeah. We should put that We can write cute higher. little notes. So he has like one picture on his fridge. And we're going to assume it's the two of them. Maybe it's his mom, I don't know. And then we brought a bunch more. We got a crock pot. There's not a lot of space for these things. Can I put this up here? Now it's telling me no, I can't put it up there. No, we're too fancy now. We gotta put it somewhere better. Oh, I can put it under there. Um. <laughs> P Ninja says it's a picture of him and Sailor Venus. <laughs> This is actually the beginning of the end of the relationship. She's moving in and then goes, What is this picture? What is this picture on the fridge? It's my whole roommate. Mom, she moved in. I think I made a mistake. We might need that knife later. Hang on to that. I hope he's okay. tuxedo mask. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, some of these things need to get moved around. P Ninja is starting a fanfic where Sailor Venus was too busy saving the world or whatever she does, and her roommate swooped in and stole her man. <laughs> yes. This whole game is nothing but Sailor Moon fanfiction now. Oh, that doesn't go. Serena and Darian are moving in together. But it turns out he was dating Sailor Venus all along. Dun dun dun. I have no idea where these implements are gonna go. Okay. Alright, at least we're done. Okay. Perfect! Um, there's a hook here. Can I hook something? Can we put this up here? No. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. It's gonna go in the bathroom. What, the colander? No, the, the brush. 
I want to put the colander in back. Uh, so I got somewhere up there. Okay. Fighting evil by moonlight. Well, I gotta sing this whole thing. Let me sing. Fighting evil by moonlight. Losing love by daylight. Always focused on the bad guys. She is the one named Sailor Moon. Written by Mochi Pup. You don't have a bathroom colander? Everyone should have a bathroom colander. I don't like the cutting board. No, cutting board on the stove. That's where it goes now. <laughs> cutting board should be here. You use it all the time. On the if stove. You're, if you're cooking. On the stove. Now he scale. doesn't. He didn't want his cutting board there. He liked his cutting board in the drawer. And you just came in here and said no. I said that's not where that goes. Uh oh. This is how it starts. <laughs> Trouble in paradise. Alright, so there. Okay. Uh, we have problems. He doesn't get to have opinions anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the kitchen is now the laptop slash. Digital drawing studio. We're just gonna move all your salt and pepper. I'm not sure why. Yeah, it seems redundant because I'm pretty sure that's salt and pepper. And He's maybe... also blocking an outlet. He well, he put those there, not yeah. me. Okay. Where? Uh... Look, we're going to be doing a lot more cooking now. No more eating out every day. Not while I'm here with my crock pot. I have a and feeling. My George Foreman grill. <laughs> yeah, he's got all those weights. We and he has the food toaster. scale. I feel like he's making his own food. Our old toaster, you know, got destroyed when a bunch of underwear caught on fire inside <laughs> it. So we had to buy this new green one. It's really nice. We've upgraded to four different types of table salt. That's how you know we're in a classy place. No, no, honey, that's the salt for the salad. Oh, wait, you I think... the steak salt. I think I found a huge thing of protein powder. Oh, yep. Yeah. We know he has a lot of weights. He does have a lot of weights. And he had that food skill that I just put in a drawer. <laughs> One is definitely Parmesan cheese. Oh, maybe? Yep. Can I get the magic bullet in here? No. I think the magic bullet should be out where everyone can see it. <laughs> can enjoy it. All right, where's your protein powder? Preferably blocking the cappuccino machine. Wow, he's not gonna be able to find anything in this kitchen. We just moved it's everything fine. around. Okay. Where's uh, my protein let's powder? Put this in the bathroom. Oh, you know. Open the. Oh, oh. Put it right next to the sham. Wow. Yes. It's the magic bullet with the sham wow. Fill them now. Does not want my trash can there. Does he even live here anymore? <laughs> well, we're gonna change the locks <laughs> while he's on this business trip. <laughs> okay. Just gonna set all um, his stuff out in the hallway. Actually, while well, I'm over here, I'm gonna do this. There. We go. Oh, good. I was worried oh. about that. Now what if you wait? What if you go back and close the closet doors in the bedroom? Maybe there's a place on the wall if you close the closet doors. Oh. Or just lay that there. At the moment. Uh. There you go. Over there on the. Whoa, oh, I took a shirt off. Little closet space. Little do a little wall space right next to the closet. Everything he owned in a box to the left. Yeah, no. It's, it's, I think it's too big. Oh, it's just too much. Well, we'll just run around the house looking for a place to hang it. You don't need all these posters. Can we take one down? No, those are bolted in. We cannot. I really wish we could. He'd come home and be like, Where's my poster? You don't need my, all of these. You took my poster. Maybe there's an office. We'll find a place. No, yeah, it's just, it's just the, yeah. Just 
shove them in anywhere. Yeah, this is gonna be a mess. Mix the books amongst the video games. People love that. Oh, I could put them under there. The book in the middle of the Xbox games. Yes. Is this a DVD movie? Is it a video game? Who knows? We're going to just put them all together on the shelf. Master Chief is not happy with the book in his face. Wow. Too many books. We may have brought too many books. Oh, you know what? I can do I can do this. Put that on the coffee table there. Yeah, just move his one object. He's got a Zen garden up there. No, the D and D dice was us. Oh, okay, that was us. Yep. We had that in the But I'm saying he's got a Zen garden. Throw that thing out in the hallway. He doesn't need that. Oh, this little this thing? Yeah. We also have like a scorpion or something. Ooh. We got that from Animal Crossing. Just noticed all the weights, yeah! Nice collection of weights. This guy likes to lift while watching yeah, TV. he does lift, for sure. He's got that huge thing of protein powder. Double he may definitely scale. need the Zen Garden when he gets home. Yep. That's, he doesn't need the Zen Garden. He has us. And we mixed GameCube games in with his Xbox games. 2011, yeah, we visited the bookstore to do trade-ins. Oh, sweetie, you didn't need all those books. This is... that goes there. Okay. Sure, that goes there. <laughs> this is the games, I don't think... Oh, oh, wait, I got a chicken. Chicken. Oh, that's perfect! Chicken right on the coffee table! What is this? This is not like... Come here. I don't know what that is. That is the DVD box set of Perfect Strangers. <laughs> okay. I don't, I don't know, I'm guessing. How did it go with the That is game? season one of Perfect Strangers on DVD. He was a big fan. There we go. That's better. Uh, I think these are tapes. Oh, those are your CDs. And baby chicken. Chicken. Oh. Gotta be with his mama. Chicken. Oh, there's another one. Another chicken. He's gonna love those. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Yeah. You know, we could fit a lot more books if we got rid of those Xbox controllers. Too many books. Or just stick a book right next to the glasses. Thought it was the full collection of Friends or Lost. Nope. I see two guys on the cover. That's definitely Perfect Strangers. two dads in there. But see, they, they got the two guys. Where's the girl? She would be there if that was my two dads. Be the two dads and the girl. And I don't remember her name. I don't remember any of their names. It was just my two dads. It was before she moved in. It's a prequel series. Just about the two dads living their best life. Before this girl shows up. Who might be a daughter to one of them? Oh, controller? Her in real life name is Stacy something. Okay, Stacy something. You're not on a DVD cover. Too bad, Stacy something. Okay, right, so this needs to go next to the GameCube. Oh, can we do that with the GameCube? <laughs> is that allowed? Is that the GameCube? Is that what this is? What is this? I think that's another like box book. set. Right there. Yep, that's all of Twin Peaks. Would love footage of the boyfriend walking in right now. 
<laughs> Hi, sweetie. I'm almost done. You're going to have chicken. a fun game finding all your stuff. <laughs> Look, honey, it's our new home. Oh, there's the GameCube. Yeah, that's the GameCube. Let's get that Xbox out of the way. Xbox well, can stand is... vertically. It will not let me do it. Oh, well, GameCube can just nuzzle right in next there to go. it. The sequel to this game. Find your stuff. Well, this is unpacking, so the logical sequel will be packing. We're gonna see how she how she lost all of these homes in the sequel. So what's in the last box? Oh, right. I forgot about this one. Oh, it's our stuff from Europe. Just throw that anywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of the ukulele up here. Like the whole chicken family living right on the table there. That's wonderful. Many bucks. There's always room for more books if we just get rid of his stuff. Maybe those glasses Killing don't me. need to be displayed like that. Well, I don't know why they're in here. I think that's weird. much more practical. Honey, why are there ten chickens on our coffee table? That's where they go. These are my emotional support chickens. You knew about them when you asked me to move in! Can we get all the chicken family up there on that shelf? What about Sailor Venus's favorite D&D &D dice that we stole when we moved out? As is our tradition, to steal one thing from each roommate to remember them. Okay, so I have this shirt. Let's take the shirt in. Running out of room. Alright, I think that's his stuff, but okay. Well. That is fine. Oh, he does not like the hat being there. Can you open the window and just start tossing this stuff out? <laughs> Making room! Watch out below! Nope. Why is the D&D dice as big as our fist? We play serious D&D. Super serious. You gotta have big dice. No, I guess it has to go on the bedroom. Oh, what? Now there's a space next to uh, your Game Boy games. In the little bedside table. Hey, I had it there and it didn't like it. What? Okay, yes, that's the jeans. There you go. Oh, you okay? Sure, stack the hat on the jeans. It literally will not just go by itself. Okay, fine. Fine, sure. it's happy. That's like a file folder. Yeah, it was up here somewhere. And then I moved it. Oh, look, you can just stack it in front of that stuff. That's fine. Okay, ukulele. Uh, next to the Game Boy games? No. No. On the floor? Under the bed? Doesn't like that. Okay, so you gotta go there. Sure. Under okay. the bed. And now he's got this. That's like a catch-all. Can we hang it in the kitchen? Oh, it does not like the magic bullet there! Uh-oh. Can I put it in the bathroom? Can we hang it in the bathroom? <laughs> I can! We can! Oh no, I didn't like it! Oh! I thought we were on to something. Do we just put it in a drawer? Throw his book bag on the floor? Which one of them is going to step on that ukulele first? Okay, well, it's under the bed. So there we go. Sure. Catch all. 
This room's happy. It's fine with the laptop just laying by the sink. Oh, I forgot about the laptop. But it's Will fine that with be that. Okay? Yeah, well... It doesn't want you to move it. Well, there's chairs there. All right. Magic Sorry. bullet and electric teacup, I think. Will the, will the magic bullet be happy by the sink? Yes. Okay. That is a great place for it. And that. Oh, but it's not saying I'm done. What else is unhappy? In the bathroom. Oh, the medicine bag. It's sitting on the floor. Can we put it in the little cubby? Oh, it's happy over there. I think it's, it's okay. It's just out of the way. Um. Everything else seems fine. No, it's, it's like the Q-tips. Boyfriend. Welcome home. A shower with a view. A shower with a view of you. I, I don't know if that's a great thing. No. Wow. This is an interesting game. Mm -hmm. I gotta say, I'm enjoying this. But I think we're out of time. Would you say so, Captain? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna call it there, and we'll have to learn about her adventures some other time. Or if you want to find out yourself. This is called uh, Unpacking, I believe, or Unpacked, something similar, and it's out now, and it's really neat. You can find out what happens with their relationship. Yes, find <laughs> out about her life and yep. how it's going to turn out, uh -huh. and see if she moves back in with her parents at the end, because that's how life works. All right, let me shut down the game here. We still got my sunset. It may not be real, but it sure does look nice. Well, I think that's going to wrap things up for this evening. And unfortunately, uh, to wrap things up, we have some sad news. Uh, because this, this is going to be the captain's last stream for a little while. Yeah. yeah it's uh, captain things need to be doing. And uh, we never intended... You know, when I started this, to have the captain here as much as we have. But it's been so nice and really appreciate ha having you here, Captain. I thank gotta say, you. thank you so much for all the time that you've spent with us. You're welcome. It's been a fun time. Yeah. But and this is not to say the captain will never be on the stream again. Just that we're going to be changing formats a little. That's right. Yeah. So the Sunday night stream is going to be going away. Because Captain's got stuff to do, so no more Sunday night stream. I am still going to be doing lunch crafting on Tuesday. Oh, drink! Mochi just ordered drinks for the Captain oh, as thanks. a send-off, just for you. Thank you very much. A frosty mug of Duff beer. Oh, I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, they're saying all these nice things. You will be missed. Captain has to go research how to get Artita back full-time. I don't know about that one. No. No. Um, but anyway, as I was saying, I will be doing the lunch crafting on Tuesday, as per usual. And since I've started this, we have had a lot of interest uh, from other people, you know, working here at the cafe. We put, a, put up a sign-up sheet, and uh, we had quite a few that were interested in joining in on these festivities. So we're going to be m mixing up the schedule here, and I'm going to be adding some stuff in the future so you can see some of our other staff here uh, and their offerings, what they can bring to the stream. So that's the plan uh, for now. We're gonna just keep an eye on the schedule or just keep the uh, notifications on and you'll see when we go live. But uh, definitely Tuesday for me and just keep an eye out for the other things that we got planned. We're gonna get those in order pretty quickly for you. Any, uh, any, any parting words, Captain, before we sign off? Um, just it's been great hanging out with everyone. I've had a great time. And I'll talk to you soon. I won't be gone for super long. That's right. I promise. It's not forever. No. Just no more regulars. 
Yes. Yeah. We really loved having you here, Captain. Thank you again so much for spending so much time on my little streaming project. Really appreciate it so much. Oh, you're welcome. Everybody I know is going to miss you, especially me. Oh, well, thank you, and I'll miss everybody and you as well. I mean, it's not like I'm not going to see you. You're, you're still here. It's not on the true. stream. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, it's not that sad. We're going to have to take care of your watch as soon as we're done here. So my you'll, watch. you'll see me then. It's fine. Isn't it? I think we have to set it again. Daylight savings. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Anyway, that's going to do it for us. Have a good night, everybody, and we'll see you next time. So long. Bye. Let me find my goodbye button. Bye-bye.